Hey, how's it going? So I wanted to make a relatively quick video today on how to fix some ruin light uh, being a little bit laggy. So you do have to keep in mind that sometimes things may be out of your control. So perhaps, you know, the servers in uh, RS might be laggy. So just go ahead and consider maybe switching worlds, uh, especially ones that are um, good for you, right? Based on where you're at. So for example, um, I live in the West of the US. So basically this is what this means here. I would try to choose some of these blue ones right here. And if you live in the East, and then of course, every other one here as well. Um, you can also go ahead and go to the website. Um, I forgot what the name is, but basically lets you know if there's uh, been reported issues with RS. You can check and maybe it's something on their behalf that way you also want to make sure that you do have your computer graphic cards updated so i'll go ahead and post a link in the description where you can go to um the nvidia website that is if you're running an uh, nvidia graphic card and actually let me show you that real quick okay so i actually already have it saved here um i'll come and check it every day Basically, you come to this website here. I'll try to copy the exact same one here. Um, and you just go ahead and search to see if there's anything going on. I have a 3070 Ti, so it's going to search. As you can see, today is the 22nd, and there was a, a new update about six days ago. So um, when you don't update your graphic drivers, you usually may have a, uh, quite a few issues. Whether, for example, at least for me, um, it's a game, right? Becoming laggy, choppy, or even if you're using, for example, another example, a gaming controller, sometimes the input won't work. I've seen this happen in Fortnite. So you're going to want to go ahead and update your drivers. Um, just go back to RS real quick. So if you're in RS, yeah, you obviously know that there's plugin, but just in case you don't, um, I'm not sure this is already pre downloaded, but I recommend you download the GPU. And then you go into it and activate it by making sure that this is highlighted orange. So if you don't have it um, activated, as far as I know, uh, it's going to be using your CPU, the game is anyways. So you're going to want it to use your, your graphics driver because that's what it's for. So go ahead and activate it and then see if that works for you. Um, I did just um, kind of reset my computer so I can upgrade to Windows 11 even though it's been out for a while. So I did have to um, basically log in into my uh, Ruin Light again. However, some of the settings were surprisingly changed. So I had to basically figure out what else could be, you know, the issue if it's not the graphic drivers and if the website is running, the game is running. Why am I lagging when before I could run so many other things? So what I found out is that if you turn off your VSync right here, um, if you turn it off, the lag just went away. That was my my fix, my solution. Um, and now I can play no lag and whatnot. I can open not as many as I want, but I can open a lot and it still works. Um, so try that for sure. Make sure this is off. If not, change some of these settings to lower. I think the only other thing that I changed was um, the draw distance, I think, where you can see further, basically. Um, just because I like it, you can see pretty far um, when you have that specific setting on. But yeah, if that's not working, uninstall and reinstall. Uh, the game might be a solution for you. And then, of course, um, if you're experiencing issues just in general with your computer, you're going to want to kind of pinpoint what the issue may be, whether you updated something like a Windows update and it started messing with your computer. Uh, you might want to revert to a previous update. Um, but if you've done everything, nothing's helping. You just might have too much clutter. Um, and I strongly recommend you consider now to um, restart your computer. But of course, save all your files and all that in a external hard drive you want to make sure you don't lose all your data 
I have a video actually uh, that shows you how to go ahead and do so. Um, it's basically inside my Windows 11 update video. Um, you can kind of see how I go about it if that's kind of the case where you're at. Um, but yeah, just kind of pinpoint the issues. Let me know what you're going through. I always try to respond to everybody and help out. But these are just some kind of semi quick uh, tips for you. And hopefully that helps out. So yeah, see ya on the next video. Don't forget to like and subscribe if this video did help you out later.